Hello, this is David Taylor at Web Media with this week's online marketing secret. And if your business relies on a good ranking on Google, then you're going to want to know about the latest blog from Matt Cutts at the search quality team at Google, where he's talking about further changes to Google's algorithm and the way that it ranks websites. Now, the thing about uh, Google is that it's constantly evolving to try and keep track with changes, but also with the way that people try to use underhand techniques to get their websites higher ranked on Google. So it's a constant battle between Google and what are called black hat SEOs. And as a result, Google keeps making changes to cut out what it considers to be poor quality content ranking high on its search engine because that's doing its, its reputation no good at all. So uh, Matt Cutts has just been talking about a big change that's coming to Google very shortly um, and it's called Penguin 2.0. Uh, he's not giving everything away by any means, but he's basically saying you should uh, follow the basic principles of creating a site that is very relevant, very authoritative, very trustworthy, and has great quality, consistent content that's regularly added to and provides a great user experience for your target audience. Now, that is the principle that you need to follow if you want to be well ranked on Google. As soon as you start trying to uh, play Google at its own game or introduce uh, uh, tactics um, that could be called black hat SEO, you're on the slippery slope to uh, being caught out. And sooner or later, you, where, whatever rank you get on Google, you're going to be found out by Google and they're going to change the algorithm and you're going to find, find yourself heavily penalized. So stay away from this kind of stuff. And two, three things that he mentioned in his blog right here, uh, I've got them for you right here. The first one, advertorials. Now this is where something, a piece of content online appears to be an editorial piece, uh, giving consumers good quality information, but actually it's been paid for. It's an advertisement that looks like editorial. If you are doing this kind of thing, then the new update from Google is likely to hit your ranking because those are going to be discounted advertorials. The next thing is link spamming. Uh, this is trading links, uh, putting links in emails, creating links in places with the sole intention of um, of improving your Google rank rather than improving the customer experience for your content. Anything like that is increasingly going get, to get penalized. And the third thing to pick up on is authority in their space. What Matt Cutts is saying is that Google is increasingly recognizing people uh, for having a particular authority in their market space. And it's going to give those people uh, a bit of a leg up a bit of an improved rank because they're recognized as being uh, an authority on a particular subject. So those are three particular areas he referred to, but Penguin is going to, uh, um, going to uh, affect a lot of sites by the sound of it. And um, as a result, you need to ensure that what you are doing or your SEO people are doing is, uh, is in line with Google's terms of reference, which means great quality content valued by your customer audience consistently added to and no funny business so that's it penguin 2.0 is on the way we'll see what happens i'll update this video blog when i know more about it until then uh, good luck with your seo and we'll see you next time for another online marketing secret bye bye